this video describes how to use the trigger and the target part of a dot measure command in LT Spice. So first of all, here is an RC circuit. So if we run this circuit, you see that it takes a while for the capacitor to charge up. And so you can kind of see it's charging and discharging until it hits a steady state. So if I want to measure what the peak-to-peak -peak amplitude is, I do a dot measure transient peak-to-peak -peak on the output. If I run this and look at the SPICE error log, it says that the peak-to-peak -peak is 1.5 volts, sometime between 0 and the 1 millisecond. So you see it's starting at 0 and going to 1 millisecond, and this is the peak-to-peak -peak from here to there. Well, we don't want to do that. We want to just measure up in this point right here. So we want to tell it when to start calculating the peak, the peak to peak and when to end. So the trigger is when to start and the target is when to end. So then I can just come in here and I can just type in a trigger. So I'm going to go trig at... And let's say I want to do it at 0.8 milliseconds. So I go 0 0.8 milliseconds. And it's going to say I'm going to start my calculation at this point. And it'll go to the end. But if I don't want it to go to end, I just want it to go to some smaller point in here. I can also use a target. So I'm going to go target at. And I'm going to go 0 0.85 milliseconds. So it's going to start at 0.8 and end at 0.85. So if I run this and I look at my SPICE directive, it says, oh, here's my peak-to-peak -peak value. And it did the calculation from this point to that point. This was defined by the trigger, and this was defined by the target.